What's up everyone? Welcome to your last workout of the Momentum program. This is your 30 minute full body and cardio workout level four. Grab your dumbbells and let's get started. What's up everyone? Welcome to your very last workout of our Momentum program. I want you to go hard in level four effort today. We're working on full body and cardio today, so let's get you set up so we can rock right into it. Okay, we've got step ups today, so grab your bench if you have something, water and a sweat towel as always, and I brought my jump rope out here today. If you have a rope or a cordless rope, we'll have one section with that in it, so either sub that out for your own cardio or grab your rope. And then light to medium dumbbells today. So I'm gonna stick between 10 and 20 pounds for myself. Everything will be a compound move, like a squat and a press, a lunge and a clean. So just be picking dumbbells that you can work for 30 seconds with at a pretty good pace, okay? We're gonna work up a good sweat with a really fun finisher. Five fives is our finisher, but we'll get there and we'll crush it together, all right? So thumbs up if you're ready. Last day, all out, level four, three, two, one, let's go. Great job, open up your hips a little bit, heels to your glutes, just being proud of what you've gotten to today. All the hard work, you're gonna show it right here. Good job, arms over your chest, big cross. Let this workout be a celebration of your strength, reminding you of all that you've done for yourself in this program, in this journey. Good job. Hands right past your body and up. Good job. Two and one. Take your left heel back, put it down on the ground. Let's lean forward and stretch your calf. Great job, straighten both legs out. Take it down, hamstring stretch. Gearing up for this workout, I want you to think of all the things that you've overcome in your journey. Good, stand up, switch legs. It's no coincidence that you're here today to hear these words, be proud of yourself. Right, bend your back leg and straighten it. Just stretch out the calf first, and then we'll go hamstring. You're here because you've gotten through all the things that life has thrown your way, that this program has thrown your way even. Okay, now down in front to the hamstring, let's go. So be proud of that and show yourself your worth all this resilience. You are resilient, you're stronger than you think and life sometimes has to throw things your way to remind you of that. Let's celebrate that in this workout. Good, both hands down on the mat, both feet back, pedal your heels. Great job, step it outside your hands, drop the back knee down, and up, switch legs. Switch. Switch again. And walk it back up, make your way back up to standing however you can. And in 25 seconds, we're gonna rock into our first superset. We've got squat and press, squat, Press, two dumbbells, okay? And then we've got skater hops right here, okay? So grab your weights, light to medium here. I want you to move at a pretty good pace. Ready? Let's go, last day, first round. Four, three, two, squat and press, let's go. 30 seconds. Fifteen. Three, two, one, rest. Dumbbells out of the way, 15 seconds rest. Skater hops can be on the ground or hopping. If you're staying on the ground, here and here. Okay, if you're hopping, keep your hips facing forward. Two, one, let's go.
15. Good. Speed it up. Three, two, one. Round two. Let's go. You've got three rounds of this superset. All right. Let's get more reps in this round or you go heavier. Four, three, two, let's go. Fifteen, good job. Two, one, good, throw them down. Whew. Feel free, jog in place if you'd like. We go in eight, skater lunges. Three, two, one, step it up, come on. Try not to just shift your hips open here. Keep them facing forward. 15. Two, one. All right, last round. Turn it up a little more. Heavier if you can. More reps if you can. It's level four, so you're all out. Let's go. Three, two, one squat and press, go. Exhale as you push, 15. Five, four, come on. And rest, beautiful. Skater hops, let's stay low, stay agile. Moving lateral, four, three, two, one, come on. Use your arms. 15 more seconds, lower and quicker, let's go. Good, four, couple more, and rest. Beautiful, grab water, first circuit is complete. We're going on to sumo squat high row and pop squats. Okay, so, Two dumbbells here. Wide stance. All right. We're gonna sit here. Sit, row high. All right, wide stance. Grab light to medium weights, but ones that will challenge you. Okay, and after that, we're gonna go pop squats. Two options here. Start together, jump out, touch the floor. Jump back together. Low impact, step out. Okay, you pick your level, let's go. Two, one, high row. Good, how to make this tougher? Get a little lower in your squat. Get a little heavier with your dumbbells. Transition a little bit quicker between high row into squat. Three, two, one. Great work, all right. Pop squats. Whew. Feet start together, you step or hop out. Doesn't matter which one, just keep moving. Four, two, one, let's go. Nice job. 
keep your intensity up by making sure you're breathing. Okay, every rep has a breath. Three, two, one, good job. High row and squat again. Heavier if you can, lighter if you need to. Come on, let's show ourselves what we can do. Four, two, one, let's go. Sit, pull. Ten seconds. You're strong, we're getting stronger. Two, one, and rest. All right, let's tap it out, pop squats. See if you can get more reps in. See if you can get back into your squat quicker. Step it up in whatever way challenges you. I'm here with you. Two, one, let's go. Breathe deep. Good. Seven. Three, two, one. All right, last round. Turn it up a little bit more. Heavier weights or more reps or less transition time. Here we go. Three. Big pull, two, one, come on. Good work. I'm with you, let's go, dig your heels in, push. Two, one, great work. Pop squats, last round. I want you to stay in the squat as much as you can. Speed these up. Whew. Ready? Four, three, two, let's go. Quick feet. Good, sit, sit, sit and then use your inner thighs to pull your heels back together. Eight seconds, a little quicker, six. Two, one, beautiful job. Circuit two, finish, grab some water. We're moving to step ups and burpees. Great job. Step ups and burpees. We're gonna alternate legs. Step up left, then right, then left, then right. Okay, after that we'll go burpees. And if you need to modify, take it down on the ground, step back, step up, or take it to an incline, okay? Big deep breath. All right, let's go. Seven seconds. Grab the weights you wanna start with. Three, two, one, just step ups. Nothing with your arms here. I am gonna challenge you in your burpees a little bit more, so focus hard on the legs and the core here. Lean over that front leg, okay? You don't need to be leaning back, pushing off the back leg. You should be here. You're taking off up here. Three, Two, one, great job. Burpees, let's go. You can either pop up and back. You can also modify to step up and back where you can do them on a bench, okay? I'm gonna challenge you to add a push up in here. So jump or hop back, push up, come up. Ready, let's go.
10. Three, two, one. Great job. Step ups again. Let's go. Two more rounds of that circuit. Here we go. Five heavier weights or more reps. Two, one. Let's go. Front leg push, come on, 15. Up, up. Two, one. All right, let's go. Back to the burpees. If you didn't add the push up first round, add it in this round. If you did, let's stay strong. Give me a quicker transition. Three. Two, one, let's go. Good job, 10 seconds. And rest, okay. Last round, come on, turn it up a little more. <sighs> Great job. Seven seconds, heavier weights. Five, three, two, one. Come on, let's go. Come on, step it up in terms of your effort, in terms of your dedication. Step it up in the way that you think about how capable you are. It's all in your head. Your body will follow. Nine. Two, one, and breathe. Burpees with the push up. Ready? Seven seconds, take a big deep breath. Let's go. Three, two, one. Burpee push up. Go. Nice work. You got 15 more seconds. Make these push ups tight. Six. Three, come on, two, one, and breathe. Circuit three is done. We're moving on. Circuit four, reverse lunge and clean and jump rope. If you have a jump rope, you wanna use it, grab it, or a cordless rope. I've also seen people swing towels or just sub out high knees, mountain climbers, whatever choice of cardio you would like to do. So, Reverse lunge and clean. I've got two dumbbells here. I'm gonna step it back. Okay, when I come up, I'm gonna extend my hips, catch the dumbbells here. Back down, sit, catch, sit, catch. Okay, let's go in three, two, one. Here we go, reverse lunge and clean. Good, push hard in the foot that's coming out of the ground or your front leg. That's where all the power should come from, from your clean or for your clean. Seven. Two, one. All right, jump rope or your choice of cardio. Whew. And with this one, if you wanna go right into it, that's fine. We officially start in five. Three, two, one, let's go. Good, arms stay relaxed down at your side. Ribs over your hips. Knees are just slightly bent. 
10. Two, one, great job. And we're back. Whew. Clean and lunge. Let's go. Four, three, two, one. Come on. Big push, front leg up. Fifteen. Five. Two. And rest. Good job. Jump rope. Go right into it. If you're ready. Whew. We officially start in seven. Three, two, one, 30 seconds, let's go. And I need all your intensity here, okay? You need it and I need it because you're worth it. Because I know you're working hard there, I'm working hard too. 15. Three, two, one. And last round of this one, let's go. Whew. Step up your weight if you can, if you feel good about this clean, okay? Powered by the front leg. Three, two, one, let's get it. Come on, front leg. One, and rest. All right, jump rope last round. Eight seconds and we officially go, but start it off here if you're ready. Three, two, one, go. Nice job, come on. Push, quick, 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 quick. Ten seconds, quicker. Seven, six, go five. Two, one, and rest. <laughs> Great work. Grab some water. Whew. Towel it off. Five exercises we're gonna do for 30 seconds each, one time through. Then we combine them for a five sets of five AMRAP. Okay, so 20 seconds, we're gonna start standing mountain climbers, right here, okay? Option for that, just drive and punch, okay? Then we go into squat jumps, tap your butt on the bench or just sit. Then we go into burpees, then mountain climbers, then bicycles, okay? Standing climbers, right here, four, three, 30 seconds, two, one, go! I'm just kind of introing you to everything that you're gonna do. Five, 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 five reps of five exercises. For our closing burnout finisher, you got 14. Good job. Four, three, two, one. Find a bench or maybe a med ball, maybe a dumbbell or just sit. Squats or squat jumps, okay? I'm gonna tap my glutes down on the bench. Four, three, two, one, let's go.
10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Now you have burpees. Incline, step it up, step it back, or full burpees. You don't have to worry about the push up here. Nine seconds, and we go. Five, three, two, one, come on. Fifteen. Breathe and go. Five. And rest. Mountain climbers, you can take it to the floor. You can either step or sprint right here. If you need to dial it back a little more, I'll go with you. Incline climbers. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Good work. 10 more seconds. Two, one. Now you flip it over, lay on your back, okay? You've got bicycles. All right, I want you to crunch up. Cross, 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 okay? If you need to modify, set up. Just lean yourself back, let's just bring it in. Two, one, let's go. Good job. Keep that crunch, lift it up. So shoulder blades are off the ground, use your core. Twelve, eleven. Two, one, and rest. Now, in 30 seconds, you've got three minutes of work left. Okay? Five reps of everything we just did. So you start up with five climbers. Five, four, three, two, one. Five squat jumps. Five burpees, five mountain climbers each leg, five bicycles, and resume as many times as you can. Okay, I'll go with you. Standing climbers, three, two, one, five each leg. Five, four, three, two, one, squat jumps, go. Five squat jumps and then five burpees. Go at your pace. It's burpees, mountain climbers, and bicycles. As soon as you get done with your bicycles, you're back up. Standing climbers. Five of everything. Five of all five. 45 seconds done. Come on. This is it. Your first minute is done. Get into your rhythm now. You got the flow. Let's go. Momentum program. Everything you've worked for is right here. It's on the line. Show yourself. Come on. Ninety seconds down, second half, let's go. It's winter now. The chill is cutting. Come on, come on. Just when you think you're about to slow down, you're out of breath. Dig deeper. When you sold us You've got one more minute. Me and you, last minute of momentum. You're at 100% right here.
Go for it, go for it. Breathe. I'm with you. This is your fastest round yet. Last 30 seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Finish like you mean it, like you've worked hard for this moment. 15 second sprint, go. Three, two, one, and breathe. You've made it to the last day. Your last workout of the Momentum program. I am so, so proud of you. Make sure you post that you finished the Momentum program on your social media. Share it with your friends, tag me. I wanna see you crushing it, drenched in sweat, and proud of yourself. You've made it to your cool down. Let's come on down to a seated position. Whew. Left leg out, right leg tucked in. Big deep breath, exhale. And just exhale any doubt that you had that you would crush this workout because you're here now and you did it. Exhale, lean out to that leg, arm comes up and over. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of you. We're showing up, we're pushing past what else you could have done right now. Switch sides. Showing up for yourself is sometimes the hardest part, right? Exhale and stretch. A lot of people have been recently asking me about motivation. How do you stay motivated? I have no energy. How do you get back to the point where you're motivated to start working out? You don't wait on motivation. You rely on your habits and your lifestyle, and you just know, I'm going to show up. This workout, I could have gone half speed, but I showed up, and that would have been better than not showing up at all. Come on over to your hands and knees. Sometimes I think we let our expectations of what we think our comeback should look like cloud the reality of it's just a refresh. You're just starting fresh. That in itself, it's gonna be imperfect, but it's so necessary to get quote unquote back on track. Walk your hands out forward. There's no waiting for a mood to jump back into what you know makes you feel your best. The mood is, I'm tired of not feeling my best, therefore I'm gonna do something about it. And you just start. Don't overthink it, don't overcomplicate it. Same thing with any workout regimen. Pregnant or sick or injured or just life happened and you took a little bit of time off. Do not overcomplicate starting again. Tuck your toes down and lift your hips up. Drive your heels to the floor. So if you're at the point right now in your fitness journey where it took a little refresh for you to get here, I'm so proud of you. If you're at the point where you're rocking and you're rolling, let's talk about it, right? Be about that lifestyle so people around you can see, all right, this person's doing it, I can too. Sometimes you need to be inspired, sometimes you are the one who is inspiring. Walk back to your toes. Bend your knees, slowly roll up to the top, make your way up slowly with your head coming up last. Sometimes you need the inspiration of just seeing someone do it, just do their thing. Just to be reminded, okay, there are people around me, I'm in good company of getting back on track. Okay, there are people around me who are working really hard for some big goals. And they might get some judgment, they might get some doubters, but there are people out there who are working really hard. Switch, crossover, maybe you're that person today. Don't underestimate how powerful you just living your truth is. For someone outside of you that you may never know about, you're living proof to them that it's possible. You're proof to them that it's not crazy to work hard for something you really want. Take your arms up overhead, pull. Okay, be that inspiration or take inspiration. Good. Slide it over. I know a lot of people have recently told me, I don't have a ton of people in my community that are healthy and fit. Just find someone who has done something where it took hard work to get there and admire. Watch what they do. Okay, heels to glutes, last stretch right here. Just always keep in mind, sometimes you need the inspiration and that's fine, but don't wait for someone to tell you, get started to do something for yourself. And at the same time, sometimes you are the inspirer. So own that truth, okay? 
be the person that you are, if you need it, if you're going to give it, whatever it is, people need the energy around them of someone's working hard right near me. And I know it's possible because of that person. Okay, momentum program is complete. You've made it to your final workout of this program. Thank you for rocking with me. I truly, truly appreciate you letting me still be your trainer, 32 weeks pregnant. And I'm so proud of how well you all have worked with me, how well you've kind of adjusted to me modifying a little bit here and there, but we're still working incredibly hard. And I'm not done yet. I've got one more program for you that I'm gonna rock with you. And then we'll see, but make sure you check out the description for all the info coming up next for our next program. But as for right now, selfies with each other to post on social media if you would like. <sighs> Momentum program is done. Before you head out, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and comment below. I crushed momentum. I'll see you for our next workout. So proud of you. Amazing work, we did it. We crushed the momentum program together. If you wanna reward yourself with a little bit of royal change gear like I'm rocking, you can check out my try on haul video where I show you sizes and colors of everything. Also, if you need a little bit more stretch, check out the link right here. And don't forget, subscribe to the channel, share it with your friends, and I'll see you back here for our next workout. Great work.